So I just did my makeup. I used the Kat Von D Lock It Foundation today. And so far, I really like it. I mean, it reminds me of the Laura Mercier Silk Cream a lot. And yeah, I will let you guys know how it holds up throughout the day. But first impressions, definitely loving it. I am brewing a second cup of coffee and then I'm gonna get dressed. And Alex and I have to head up to LA today for a meeting for the wedding. He woke up at like 7 a.m. He wakes up really early, but then he went back to sleep and he's asleep right now. We have to leave in like 20 minutes. So I told him, you need to get up and he didn't want to. Also, my eyeliner on this eye is driving me a little bit crazy because on Snapchat it looks like it's not even, but in person it is, I don't get it. I'm also having a little bit of FOMO today because I have four girls here at the sticker shop. So that's all of them. I only have the four. And um, I have to leave them because I have to go to this meeting and I really don't want to because it's Monday and I have so many orders and customer service messages to get to. I just want to stay and do them, but I have to go. So if you have a outstanding customer service message, I will answer it tonight once I get back in. Hi, little one. Baby can. We are on our way! Wee! Say we. Woo! Woo! I was like fine this morning getting up and getting ready and like tackling the day and now I'm in the car and I'm so tired. When I get home, I need to work on the shop. I have a pre-sale that I need to package and get out. I had ended up doing two pre-sales in a row. I did Caribbean Coral and then I did Hawaii like back to back because I hadn't done a pre-sale in a while. Also, I need to get rid of this gum so I can like see it when I'm talking and that's one of my pet peeves. Babe, will you take my gum? <laughs> I have two more kits that I'm in the middle of designing right now that I am in love with. I'm so excited about them. I can't wait for them to come out for pre-sale. Also, thank you guys for all of your positive feedback on my decluttering last night. Um, a lot of people really enjoyed watching it and enjoyed me putting it on YouTube. I did get a couple of comments from people saying that they felt like I shouldn't be getting rid of high-end stuff, that I should be trying to use it all up, and that they were just surprised that I would spend so much money on stuff and then just turn around and give it away. To that, I want to say that 95% of what you saw was sent to me through PR mailings that all of the beauty bloggers and beauty YouTubers get. Um, I'm not saying I'm not appreciative for that stuff because I love it, but there's literally only so much makeup that any one person can use, makeup addict or not, like all bloggers need to go through their stash sometimes. I have found over the years of this, you know, being sent a lot of stuff and then having to call it every now and then, I feel like it's really easy to get buried, to start getting buried by all your stuff, feeling like you're drowning, feeling like you just don't have a grasp on it. And that sounds super dramatic and super hashtag first world problems, but I just think it's like good to be aware of it and try to like manage it, you know? I've seen the movie Final Destination, like that series, you know the one where there's the log truck that like falls on the highway? I get so scared every time! So far I'm very impressed by the Kat Von D Locket Foundation. I think that it's, yeah, of course I've only added on for like an hour and a half, but it's staying so far. You guys, I was at zero orders last Thursday before Friday's restock, and now I don't even want to tell you guys. It's like not including pre-sales, which my pre-sale shop has probably a thousand open, but they're not ready to go out yet. On my main shop, I probably have like 600 that I need to go through. Like, you guys are the best. Like the fact that I have that many orders, it's amazing because it means that you guys are being really supportive and you love my stickers, and that makes me really happy. And I couldn't do it without. But I want to go through them like as soon as possible and get them out to you guys so you can enjoy your stickers. Yeah, so we can all enjoy our stickers. We are having a lovely lunch in downtown LA, sitting outside. That is my view. And we're going through a lot of wedding stuff. So that's really exciting. It's coming up. Guys, I fell asleep in the car on the way back and I slept the whole way. And now I'm here and I'm so Today's just like a sleepy day. I don't know what it is. But I just checked on the girls and they all have projects that are keeping them busy. So I think I'm just going to like take a bubble bath and then work.
It's one of the perks from being your own boss and working from home is that you get to make those calls. You get to say, I'm tired, I'm gonna take a bath, and then I'm gonna do all my work. Or, no, you can't do that, you're busy. Foundation is holding up really, really well, and it was very hot, and we were outside for a long time. Um, I was definitely feeling rather sweaty, and it's holding up. Sticker Shop hey. Sorority! We decided today that you are the great grand big. Kira. Great grand big. I like and it. And then I'm the great great grand big. That, that would make you, you Mel the, the grand big. Hello. Hello. And then Kim the big. And then Ashley's the little. This is Ashley the little. I asked her, I was like, do you want You to guys switch? put the little in the other room. She and you guys. Yeah, do your time. <laughs> Get in there. My girls have named themselves Alpha Glamma Plana. It's a plan words because my sorority was Alpha Chi Omega, Alpha Glamma Plana for Glam Planner. I thought it was clever. Anyway, that's like our group chat name on our phone. Coffee PJ pants have been put on and my slippers. Um, gotta be comfy if we're gonna do a little bit of relaxing and then sticker work. If I should nap with me and a baby cat. I'm just gonna lay down for like a few minutes and then I'm gonna work. I can't remember the last time I napped like in the middle of the day, but I'm so sleepy today. I didn't get very much sleeps. Kara and I are doing a late night in and out. I just woke up, Alex came in and like accidentally woke me up and I was like, what, where am I? Actually, my makeup still looks pretty dang intact even after a pretty long nap. So, foundation approved. Oh my gosh, the lady in the car next to us was so rude just now. Oh my gosh. I just want to say that this in and out run was her idea. And I jumped on. You guys, we're legit wearing our PJs. Yes, we are. We are ghetto. I just want to show you guys like how beautiful LA is. Well, we're not really in LA, but like, Southern California. It's just so pretty. Everything's so pretty. Guys, that guy that just took our order was really good looking. And Kira, I think he wants he your liked digits. My shirt. He liked it. I've had a lot of questions about the sticker shop and how I found the girls that work for me. Where's the shop? How does it work? Blah, 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 blah. Kira was my very first person that came to start helping me with it when I was like really busy at the beginning. She was the first one that was like, I can put some hours in. And then from there, she recommended the next girl who recommended the next girl who recommended the next girl. So they're kind of like a chain of command. And that's why earlier we were making the joke that it's like great, grand, big, great, great grand, big, 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 <laughs> what? <laughs> Little? What? <laughs> The lighting was funky there for a while. The lighting's like going in and out because it's like kind of <laughs> in and out, get it? <laughs> oh my God, lamest joke ever. <laughs> joke. <laughs> um, yeah, because it's like getting nighttime and we're going like in and out of areas anyway. How do you feel about being the great, grand, big to everyone? I'm so old. No. no. I love it. I love everyone. You're like the mother godmother of everyone. I swoop in for like two days at a time. She does. Kara is not full time, so she comes in when she feels like it, which, which is not as often as I would want her there. <laughs> had a couple of requests to show off my skincare cocktail for the night like I've been doing the past couple nights. So I thought I would show you. I was wearing makeup today so I'm doing a double cleanse. First up is MAC Cleanse Off Oil. I love this stuff. It gets off everything, even your eye makeup, your mascara, your eyeliner. It doesn't irritate your eyes. It's incredible. After that, I use some sort of secondary cleanser. Tonight I'm using the Glam Glow Super Cleanse Daily Clearing Cleanser. I love all of the Glam Glow cleansers. I'm skipping my acid toner for the night because I've done it two nights in a row, but I'm doing a soothing toner instead. This is the Liz Earl Instant Boost Skin Tonic. Then my serum is the Sunday Riley Luna Sleeping Oil, and I'm using the Sunday Riley Tidal Cream as a moisturizer. You guys want to come to bed? Yeah, come to bed. Come on, it's bedtime. Yeah. Come on, Mr. B Cone. Come on, be calm. Come on. Yeah, come on. Stretch. 